All right, everybody, we're going to talk about today compound subjects and predicates. So we kind of hinted on this on our activity, our relay last week. Um, but we're going to talk about it more in depth today. So go ahead, as always, um, go ahead and take this, put it in a notability, create a new note, I'm going to import it in, and we're going to get started. Okay? So when we talk about this uh, concept, apologize, come on. There we go, okay, apologize for that. Uh, so when we talk about this concept, it's gonna sound very, very familiar to you because it's not really that different from what we've seen before. So um, make sure you're following along. We are always gonna start by talking about compound subjects. So a compound subject, sorry, ran out of room, is made up of two or more subjects. So basically just what it sounds like, a compound subject, you're adding two or more subjects together that share a verb, okay? So for example, you have the subject Jimmy and you have the subject Bobby. They both ate, there's your verb. So Jimmy and Bobby ate ice cream. They both did it, they're sharing this verb, okay? Very, very similarly, a compound predicate is made up of two or more predicates that share, you can guess it, a subject. So for instance, you have Jimmy, there's your subject, he did two things. He ate ice cream and then biked to the park. So he's doing two things at once. You have your verb ate and you have your verb biked. Okay? So what I want you to do is there is a one pager in Schoology. Go ahead and click on that. Um, put it in uh, into Notability, fill it out. Then you're gonna underline the subject of each sentence once and the predicate twice. And then um, you are going to tell me if they're fragments or sentences, okay? Don't worry about this part. But that's all we're going to take for notes for this one. There's one other section of grammar notes, and then there are a couple of vocab terms. But this is all we've got for this. So go ahead and click on this subject and predicates one-pager here. Um, it is in the same folder you found these notes in, okay? All right, see you in the next video.